Hey guys, thank you so much for clicking on to another DOI Creation 7 video. Okay guys, this is going to be hopefully a pretty quick video. I wanted to come by and share with you guys some items that I'm getting ready to give off to someone. And I want to share with you guys what I made. But before I get started, you know I always like to give glory, honor, and praise to the Most High Yah. So I got these, I already had them bagged up, hold on for a second, I already had them bagged up, and this is a gift, but I'll show you what it is. But before that, I know you guys probably be checking out this little necklace right here. I just created this today. I have some rings, so you see that? I have some rings, some big rings, and I crocheted around the rings in black, and then I outlined it with the ruffled stitch in gray, and then I just made a chain long enough to go around my neck doing single crochets and, yeah, just single crochet in gray and black, and I thought that was so cute. That is so cute. I was just messing around today after I got to, through making these couple of items right here. I was like, okay, I, I got some black. I got some gray. I'm just going to make me a necklace. What do you guys think about that necklace? It's simple. It's cute, right? All right. So I wanted to show you exactly just in case someone asks what ring did I use. I use these rings right here. So I just crocheted around it, single crocheted around it, uh, in a row of black, and then triple, I mean, um, three crochets in each stitch to get that ruffleness. And then a long chain, and then came back around in single crochet. So I like how that turned out. That's cute. Yep. So that is that. And another thing that I made is this right here let me show you let me show you so I made this infinity scar but I made the infinity scars with fringes so let me try it on so here's the infinity scar okay Sorry for that length going across. And I just added some gray fringes. Just like that. Yep. So this is great for this time right here. Even though we got a little snow, but eventually it's going to get really nice here in Chicago. So these scarves right here are pretty much year round. Especially when you say... In a state like uh, mine, which is Chicago, we get cool weather in the springtime, in the summertime, you know, all year long. So, that is that. Yeah, I like this. I decided to add fringes. So, that's an infinity scarf that I made. And these scarves work up so quickly. I really love how they are so there it is I probably need to uh, I probably need to cut my fringes to make them even so I might just do that but it's in black and gray this is for her and this is for him okay which is A gray one but this one doesn't have any fringes so a nice long infinity scarf and the way that I make my infinity scarves I don't make the scarf and then sew it up I make it in round so I will have the tutorial if you are interested in making this scarf right here this infinity scarf 
I will have the tutorial available for you guys on Friday. So be looking out for that tutorial. I have these in like almost every color. And I promise you, this is one of those infinity scars you can make in a day. Because it only takes like a, a few hours to make. And the reason being is you're using a large crochet hook. This is a four ply yarn. This is the mainstay yarn in gray. So yeah, I made both of these today. Well, I started the black one on. I started the black one on yesterday, and then um, I finished it up this morning, and then I finished this up today. So I got through well both of these uh, items in one day. So yeah, and this one right here. So, you know, I was on a roll. I was at work, but I was crocheting while I was at work because these numbers. So, again, be looking out for this tutorial. It will be available for you guys on Friday. So, let me show you the bag. I picked up a bag to put this item in because it is a gift. But let me show you the bag that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. The Dollar Tree have some really pretty um, gift bags to me. They really have some really nice ones. So here's the bag. I already put the uh, tissue paper in there. But this is the bag that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. I really like that. That's going to be my thumbnail. So yeah, I really... Um, I like this bag right here so I will be like I said I already have the tissue paper in there I already have whatever else I gotta put in there and then I wanted to make something from my hand so that it could be um, you know it'll have more sentimental value than if I would have just went on and purchased something so yeah guys uh, like I said it's not gonna be a long video I just wanted to show you guys what I am getting ready to deliver as today and I wanted to also come by and share with you guys about um, comments that's not being shown but they actually go on into spam I don't know why certain comments go to spam and I was clicking on something today it told me to review my comments and it showed that one comment but when I went to my community it had like 59 comments that I never I never seen so um, usually you guys know that if you don't know I'll answer a comment even if it was months ago if I missed that comment and someone uh, give a more current comments and I might scroll down to see who you know make sure I had a re uh, comment back to somebody um, so I will you know comment but today I was playing around on my uh, in my community the analytics and my channel and the creative studio um, you guys know who does uh, YouTube videos and I clicked on um, all spams and I realized that I had 59 spams or 59 uh, comments that went to spam and again I, I know a lot of times it will go to spam if you have a link associated with that comment it would not go through but some of my comments are people who comment before on a lot of my videos and it went to spam. So I don't know what's going on with that. But I didn't want nobody to feel like they left me a comment and I totally ignored. Um, even if they said thumbs up, super cute, whatever they made a left, I like to, you know, reply back. Even if it's just with a heart, you know, just saying that I acknowledge that I got your comment. But. I didn't even know I had that many comments on, you know, on uh, respond to. So I just wanted to come back and share that with you guys. So if you leave me a comment and you get that reply back a week later or a month later, just know I'll be just not seeing that comment. And that's why I'm just not replying back to the comments. So please make sure you continue to put the comments there and, Leave me your thoughts, your feedbacks, and everything like that. All right, guys. I just wanted to stop in really quick to share with you guys these two gifts that this is mine. 
I was just testing something out. Uh, but those two gifts that's getting ready to be delivered today, I wanted to show you guys those. And for those folks who are interested in this one here, um, please make sure you be looking out for that video on Friday and you'll see how I make my infinity scarves probably a little different than everyone else, but it's still simple. It's beginners friendly. All right, guys, until next video, I think that is it. Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. There should be a small subscribe button somewhere at the bottom or the top. And please make sure you're clicking on your notary bell so that you can be notified when I upload new videos. All right, guys, until next video, always remember y'all Psalm 68.4 in your King James Version. Always keep your life and your health in check. And I'll be checking you guys in the next video really, really soon. Bye for now. Peace.